Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to create a new news item, edit that news item, and delete the news item. First, you'll start in your course. The news widget in the middle of the screen, you'll click on the plus sign to create a new news item. Here you'll type in the headline, add your content, Below the content box, you have the availability to show the start date along with the news item. As long as this box is checked, it will show the time and date that the news item became available. By clicking on the box here, you can check your date. You can change the time. If you want the news item to disappear after a certain date, be sure to check Remove News Item Based on End Date and set your end date. You can add a file such as a PDF document, a Word document, a PowerPoint, uh, an image, simply by clicking on Add File and then browsing for the file on your computer. Additional release conditions can be added to make the news item available once a certain action has been taken by the student. We will cover release conditions in a future video. If you would like to save this news item as a draft that you can come back and edit later, you can click on Save as Draft. If you're ready to publish the news item, go ahead and click on Publish. On this news item page, it will list all of your news items as well as the start and end dates and whether that news item has been published or not. You also have the availability to edit and delete news items from here. You can reorder your news items. You can also create a new news item from this page. The RSS feed we will go over in a future video. If you would like to delete multiple news items, you can click the box next to the news items to select them and click the trash can here to delete. If we go back to the course home page, You'll see our welcome news item along with the date that it was originally posted. Here you have your edit and your trash can buttons to edit the news item and delete it. The X here dismisses the news item, meaning that you've read it but it's still there. For you as an instructor, if you want to go in and edit any of your news item tools, you can click on the uh, newspaper icon here. Click on the pencil to edit the upcoming test. Notice there is a major edit uh, checkbox here, so if you make a change and you want everybody to see the change, be sure you check major edit. Uh, if the student has dismissed the news item and you don't check major edit, then they might not see this change that you just made. So if we go back to Course Home, the news item should be listed there again because we made a major edit change. And that's how you create a news item. That's how you edit a news item and we'll delete a news item.